another year, another significant loss for the Kansas Jayhawks. This time, it's Sudoka Azubike. The big man suffered a season-ending injury during practice this week, as revealed by an MRI on Sunday, as UBK has torn ligaments in his right hand. Kansas opened the season as national title favorites, but that reputation has taken a hit in recent weeks, first with losses to Arizona State and Iowa State, the latter at home, no less, and then the loss of Azubike. Azubike's loss will sting for some time. He's one of the more gifted big men in college basketball, with the ability to impose his will in the paint. Prior to this injury, Azubike averaged 13.4 points, 6.8 rebounds, and 1.6 blocks per game. He achieved those numbers in just over eight games, as he dealt with a sprained ankle earlier this season, sidelining him for several games. That's the rub with Azubike. It's unfair to call any player injury-prone, as different and unique circumstances generally lead to each injury an individual suffers, no matter how frequently they occur. But as UBK has had little luck staying on the court during his collegiate career, he tore a tendon in his other hand during his freshman year, ending that season early. As UBK didn't make it to the end of last season, either. If nothing else, Kansas has legitimate experience navigating choppy waters without their center, especially considering Silvio de Sosa's sustained absence. In fact, this could ultimately be to Kansas' advantage, as hard as it is to imagine now. Well as Ubike is a player of many talents, his more traditional post-game doesn't fit with the modern college basketball landscape. Case in point, he's never hoisted a three-pointer. Bill Self will be forced to resort to a smaller lineup, but that can work out well, just ask the Golden State Warriors. In all seriousness, a lineup featuring Dedrick Lawson inside and Marcus Garrett, LeGerald Vick, Devin Dotson, and Quentin Graham sounding the perimeter sounds intimidating on paper. It didn't quite work against Iowa State, but Self will have time to tinker with it this week, which should put Kansas on a path to success. Next, key injured players set to return but it's too soon to count them out of either the Big 12 or national title races, look the loss of Udoka as UBK isn't a small matter for the Jayhawks.